going to be doing the um, subway, the um, subway route list, tier list. Okay, I'm going to start it doing quiz. Just realized my ad locker is not working. Hold on. That's odd. Okay. Anyway, this is the first route we're gonna do. We're gonna start with the IRT, the one. Now, I don't really know much about the one. It's it, it, it's a decent it's a decent route, I guess. It, it gets you to along the west side pretty quick, you know. It it runs in a relatively straight line. It, it's I mean it's local, but that's. I guess not really a problem. But anyway, yeah, I'm gonna put this up into B tier. I don't know much about it, so I can't really speak on it. The two, it runs express along 7th Avenue. Really cool, it goes very fast. Um, runs along Lennox line, Lennox Avenue line, which is pretty cool. But other than that, it, it's, a, it's, a, it's a cool route, it's cool route, so I'll give it, um... I'll put it up into A tier. Now the three, they don't call it the Red Rocket for no reason. I I've been on a three and I've reached speeds 50 miles per hour. It runs R62s, which are the best rolling stock of any train in the subway. Um, it, it goes pretty far. It's a pretty long route. And it doesn't make too many local stops. Once you really, once you reach into Manhattan, you're not making too many local stops. So, um, yeah, I'm going to put three up into W Man's tier. The four. Now, the four goes express on, um, Lexington. Um, therefore, it's ass. But I don't really know much about the four. All I know is that it goes along Lexington Avenue, so I'm gonna give it, I'm gonna put it into B tier. I do know that I, it might run with pretty shit headways, but other than that, it's cool. The five, straight into God tier. It, it, it runs on the coolest little piece of straight track, hauling ass between stations, between 180th and, um, and Dyer Avenue. It's got the nicest stops, looks cool as hell. I'm gonna put that up into S tier, you know, and it runs express on Lexington, but I, I think the good outweighs the bad with this one. The 6X, pretty obsolete, I'm gonna put it into C tier, same with the 6. I'm doing this solely to piss people from the Bronx off, by the way. 7X, nothing needs to be said. 7, nothing needs to be said. God headways, God fleet, going like 80 miles per hour on the Super Express during Mets games. It's insane, bro. Now the A gonna put it into C tier has ass headways, especially in the Rockaways. Um, it's media. I mean, it has really nice scenery heading into the Rockaways, and you can go really fast on the Rockaway straight. But other than that, it's it's a decent decent route. So um, yeah, I'm gonna put it into C tier. The B, yeah, mobbing. I mean, I was about to say you're mobbing up Eighth Avenue, but nah. Um, I'm not sure. I'm torn on the where to put this. I like how it goes express on Brighton line, but I think it. I think it would be cool if it went all the way down the Coney. But at the same time, that would be kind of useless if it would go on the Coney. So um, I don't know. It runs on Eighth Avenue local, and it doesn't really run very often. So I'm gonna put it into C tier. Um, the C train, I'm gonna put that right into Z tier. The Z train tier. Um, it, it runs with even worse headways than the, It's basically the local version of the A, except it doesn't go as far. It only ends at Euclid. Um, it's a, it's a pretty, it's a pretty poopy route, I'm not gonna lie. It goes from 168th to Euclid. It's basically a shorter version of the A that runs local. Um, it runs a decent fleet. But it also runs trains out of Shitkin Yard, so yeah. Um, L tier. That's that's a L room, man. L man's L man's. The D. Mm. Now I like D. I I've I've um my old houses that I used to live in in Harlem were off 155th, 
So I'm gonna put this in. I'm gonna put it into A tier. It runs super. Listen, 125th to 59th in seven minutes. I mean, you can't really beat that. I know the A does those same times, but come on, bro. It's pretty awesome. Not gonna lie, pretty awesome if you ask me. Um, with the E Homeless Express. I'm doing this to pick spi um piss pixel. The F, just as bad as the E. The G, got to. Listen, we need more routes like the G. People be like, oh, I don't like the G because it doesn't go into Manhattan. The p the G was made just to not go into Manhattan. It wasn't made to piss y'all folders off. It was made to actually be convenient. So people from Brooklyn don't have to go into Manhattan just to go to, like, Long Island City or just to go to this area. Like, it's a useful route. Y'all just in the Nile. Um, the J... It, I'm gonna put it. I'm gonna. It's it's, it's a skip stop service. All right. So I'm gonna put it into B tier. The L. It, it's decent. All right. It was having some problems after Hurricane Sandy. It was running like ass. I've seen times where it's where like the L was coming in like three years. I saw I saw that. Maybe y'all have too. Um. It make it, it has really cool stations. Um. It makes a lot of turns. That's the only thing. But it actually does get to pretty. Gets to go pretty fast between Sutter and Alabama. I've been on some L's going pretty fast. It connects with the three on um, Livonia and Junius. That, that, that's really all I know about the L. It's cool. It goes on 14th and yeah. Um, I'm going to put it into the B tier. The M. I, I haven't really experienced any problems with the M, you know? It has decent headways. Doesn't really, it, isn't, it isn't really delayed often. I'm gonna put it into the A tier. Now the N, listen. I could rant so much about the N because this is the only route that I actually take on a daily basis. Um, it, it's it's pretty poopy, not gonna lie. I was um I was fanning with friends at 36th Avenue the other day, or yesterday I should say, and um I went to the um Dip Mars bound side. It was one train coming in five minutes and then 45 minutes. This was on a Saturday, right? I went to the other side. Still will have, still will have bound trains. I was looking and one of them said five minutes and then there was no other trains to still will. It was insane. So, yeah. I'm going to put that into C tier for ass headways. The Q, I'm going to put it into A tier. It's the it's OG route, all right? It has really nice stations above sec um above fifty seventh and seventh. Um, it runs it runs pretty fast around that area on the Second Avenue subway. Um, goes down the Coney Island. It, it's it's a cool route. It's a cool route. So I'll be giving it a tier. The the R it, it's it's the worst route on the Broadway line by far. It's basically like the C, but Broadway. Um, it doesn't run the Bay Ridge. It literally operates as a shuttle between um, 59th and 36th now after the um, construction's happening. Now, S, it, it's not really descriptive, but I'm going to put the S's. I, I, I'm going to assume that this is a 42nd Street shuttle, and I'm going to put it into Z tier. You're probably wondering. I'm just going to say this right now. 42nd Street shuttle is probably the most useless route in the MTA. Just take the 7. It's faster. It's nicer, they run nicer trains. No offense to the R62s because those are really nice. It like uh, there's no there's no reason for the uh, for the 40 second street shuttle to exist, alright? The other shuttles though, Franklin Avenue is good. Rockaway shuttle really carried the Rockaways after um Sandy. You know. But other than that, it is it's cool, right? The W, I'm gonna put it on, on um, B tier. All right, it's useful as a gap filler, but that's really it. It's useful as a gap filler on the end in Astoria. That's really only only thing it's useful for. The Z, it's 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 a Z, bro. The only reason it's a, it's a, it's, a, it's like a decent route is because it goes express on um, Nassau, and I like express routes, but I don't like the Z takes away from the J service really really screws up J service on um Jamaica Avenue 
like between 121st and Broadway. Other than that, this is uh, this is the tier list. This is my subway tier list. This is an opinion. So don't um crucify me if you disagree with any of the opinions I put here. And yeah, thank you for watching. Um, like and subscribe and goodbye.